Hello everyone, it's Lizzie and welcome to my channel. So as you can tell from the title, today is going to be a Louis Vuitton unboxing. I recently purchased the six key holder, which was also in my luxury wish list. Um, yep, yeah, so I finally picked up um, this SLG so I'm just gonna unbox it with you guys this shouldn't take too long because it's such a small item but definitely stay tuned because I do have a few um, unboxings coming up but let's open this bad boy up so um, I actually purchased this from the Louis Vuitton website I didn't actually go into the store just because I can't be bothered for all of that I feel like I'd only really want to go into the store if I'm buying um, the bag but it's just I feel like they package it so beautifully and I'm like, oh, I don't want to mess it up. But... So, I ended up picking the monogram. So this does come in a few different prints, if most of you probably know. Uh, but I decided to go for the um, monogram as opposed to the Demier Ben, as well as some of the other, like, prints or, like, other prints that they have. So I decided to opt for the six key holder as opposed to the four key holder because to me the price different price difference wasn't that much and I also felt that I'd rather have like um like extra space in case I have extra keys because with the four key holder you're only limited to four keys whereas this obviously you have six you have two extra spaces so I probably won't fill up all of these but I just felt like I'd rather have this rather than be limited to the four key holder and the price difference wasn't a huge difference for me to want to get the four key holder so this retails for 265 us dollars um, and here in the uk it retails for 170 pounds so um, a few weeks ago i'm not sure when you're going to watch this but um recently louis vuitton has increased their prices as they usually do and uh, but luckily um the six key holder as well as some of the other slgs um they've stayed at the same price i know the mini pochette has gone up in price which is I'm not even going to bother with that. <laughs> that was also in my wish list, but I don't think I'm even going to bother myself because it's going to be near impossible to find. And the price is just, it's close. It's, I can't, I'm going to have it on the screen somewhere, but um, for the price, I don't think it's worth it anymore because it's just ridiculous. So here is just a close up um, of the six key holder. Um, here are the dimensions um, on the screen. Um, I also have the reverse monogram key holder. Um, so you can see in terms of size reference. Um, it has, of course, the snapped closure. So when I decided I wanted to go for the monogram, I initially wanted to get the, um, the fuchsia shade, which I think is absolutely stunning. Like, it's just this really cool pop of color. But then I was watching videos and people were basically saying that the button wears off because it's not like this... Um, like metal material it's like i'm not sure what the material is but it's not as durable so over time it does kind of like come off um and just really wears and it wears really quickly and i just didn't want to have to deal with that like because i know this is going to be something that i'm going to use every single day so it's bound that if i was to get the future one like the button would wear out like to me like in a few months i didn't want to have to deal with that so i opted just to get just to get the um plain brown um, lining like this of course inside it holds six keys and then it has the cross grain um, leather it has this kind of bar where you just hold it down and slide it either to the left or right and that way you can just easily put your keys on there so it's a little bit kind of fiddly, but I managed to get my keys and my car fob in there. Um, and you can also, which I didn't know, you, there's like a compartment in the back where you can actually slide some cards back there. So if you didn't want to take a card holder or a wallet, you can just slide some cards in the back. Um, I wouldn't put too many, maybe like one or two, probably maximum three. So you can see that it fits in there really well. Um, I like I said I need to get the gold rings because I, I can't stand how it's like silver and gold and it just looks a hot mess right now um, and I just bought the rings from eBay but um, oh my gosh it actually doesn't close so I think once I get the rings okay so you can see if I close it here car fob kind of hangs out and I kind of don't like that so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get 
a ring that it's on now i'm gonna double it once my gold rings come in i'm gonna double it so it kind of like hangs and like dangles almost like a key ring um because i don't like the way it just like is just hanging out of the the um key holder like this but um yeah i'm really really happy with this um mine is made in paris i know some people like really care about where it's made i feel like maybe i don't know enough about like luxury items um but for me i'm not entirely bothered that might change down the line but um if you care to know it is made in paris but i absolutely love it i think it's gorgeous and like i said here it is beside my monogram um reverse monogram card holder um yeah so i absolutely love it um i just need to sort out the whole ring situation and like how my car fob is gonna um like sit in here but for the most part i really really like it and i like that it's really compact because oftentimes i leave my keys at home or i forget them or i can't find them whereas here i feel like it's all in one place it's quite compact and it's i feel like i'm less likely to lose my keys or um anything like that um oh i just managed to fit it in but you can see it's quite bulky i don't know if you can see from the side it's quite bulky but once i get the rings i feel like it will make a bit more sense but yeah i'm really really happy with this like i said i do have a few luxury unboxings coming up so definitely stay tuned um because hopefully if i can get my hands on it there's one bag from louis vuitton so can you guess what bag it is it is in my wish list um, and with these price increases i'm just like you know what it's just just get it now because if you don't get it and you keep thinking about it the price is just going to keep going up but um yeah that's all for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys have this um six key holder or the um four key holder let me know how it's um like in terms of the wear like if it's has any you know scuffs or anything or like let me know how durable it is because this is something that i feel like i'm going to use constantly so i want to know sort of how it holds up um but yeah so that is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed it like i said stay tuned because there's more luxury videos coming soon but if you haven't already definitely subscribe to my channel so you can get notified for when i next upload but thank you all so much for watching and i will see you all in my next video bye